please, and I'll park on the band practice area. Good morning, it's Friday, August 11th. I'm Levi James, and you're watching the JHS Report. You must get a parking permit if you drive to school. Good morning, I'm Lee Nevis. Starting today, you can pick up an application for student parking in room 210 after school. Once the application is completed, return it to room 210 with $2, and you will be issued a hang tough. All information must be filled out and completed on the application. Deadline to get a parking pass this year is August 31st. Attention AM Prosser students, you must get on the bus via the second hallway. You must have permission from the dean to drive to Prosser. PM Prosser students, you must get on the bus in front of the school by the main office. You must have permission from the dean to drive to Prosser as well. The first art club meeting will be Monday, August 21st in room 704 from 2.30 to 3.15. See Mrs. Strzok for more information. Students and staff, please do not park on the marching band practice field on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays after 4.30 in the afternoon. The band practice field is located near the football stadium and stretches from the fence to the parking lot spaces, just past the light post closest to the gym. It is lined exactly as the football field would be, but in yellow paint on the blacktop. If you have any doubts, do not park there. Your parking privileges can be revoked and your car can be towed. Any students in Students interested in volunteering at the J.B. Ogle Animal Shelter need to call the shelter at 282-0071. Join the student volunteer program and earn community service hours for your college resume. Call the shelter at 282-0071. Families are needed who would like to host male students from Saudi Arabia, India, and Egypt. The students are anxious to learn about all Americans and how we live and are very excited about being a member of the family. If you're interested in being a brother or sister, Please see Ms. Boche in room 306 for more information. And now here's today's Did You Know question. What did Voyager 2 discover on this day in 1989? We will have the answer for you after the break. <laughs> to meet my best friend Louie. I've had a lot of outstanding teammates in my life, but this guy's the best. And we both need your help. Louie and I want you to know that the J.B. Ogo Animal Shelter here in Jeffersonville has a tremendous need for loving homes for dogs and cats. Human touch goes a long way. For more information, contact the J.B. Ogo Animal Shelter. That's 282-0071. Right, Louie? If you want to do something special for your friend on their birthday, buy them a video birthday card. You can buy 20 seconds of video with a picture and or a message for $5. Just come down to the WJHS studio in room 713, but please give us three days in advance and it will air on their birthday. Good morning, I'm Jordan Lewis with a look at today's JHS weather forecast. Today, mixed clouds and sun with scattered thunderstorms, high of 78. Tonight, isolated thunderstorms early and partly cloudy after midnight, low of 67. Tomorrow, a few clouds from time to time, and a high of 84. That's a look at your JHS weather forecast. Now here's a look at JHS sports. Here's how Jeff High Sports are shaping up. Tonight, the Red Devil football team will be action in action at home with a scrimmage against New Albany at Player Field. Cost to get in will be three bucks. And the football boosters will have a full concession stand that includes grilled hamburgers and hot dogs. Also, the football boosters will be selling new Jeff football shirts and hoodies. Prices range from $10 to $25. Come out and support our Red Devils. Attention all freshman football players. If you're interested in playing, please see Mr. Strzok in room 113 or Mr. Danner. Practice is immediately after school today. It's the last day to come out. Attention wrestlers, please pick up your preseason wrestling schedule from Coach Strzok. Next Tuesday will be the first weightlifting session of the fall. 
All those interested in wrestling are welcome to attend. And that's all for Just Sports. Now here's the answer to today's Did You Know question. What did Voyager 2 discover on this day in 1989? The answer is, Voyager 2 revealed that Neptune has partial rings. During 1989, six satellites and several rings around the planet were discovered by Voyager 2. That's the news for Levi James. I'm Lee Nevis. Thanks for watching the JHS Report.